Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Praetorian. And Jinx here. And welcome back to Civilization VI on the PlayStation 4 Pro. I just wanted to get a close-up view of our runway here. Beautiful. No airplanes. No airplanes. <laughs> we eventually get some, guys. Uh, though we might wait till we get the newer ones. I think we're going to be getting those soon so that we don't have to pay to upgrade them. Speaking of uh, paying to upgrade units, I think there's quite a few units that need to be upgraded. I know our ironclads need to be turned into destroyers. I think we can get a tank here. If I'm not mistaken. Tank. Yes. Uh, we can turn him into a tank. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that. And then we have infantry. Uh, two that can, the muskmen can be up, uh, upgraded to infantry. Uh, however, the redcoats do not upgrade to the infantry. Which I found interesting. I'm not sure when they uh, upgrade. Might need to take a look at their, uh, uh, you know, the Civapedia entry. Uh, I think we have another guy here. We also have a medic. Uh, so she could be upgraded. When did we get one of those? Well, it was a tower. And it's a support unit. And so the support units are all one line. Oh, I so see. So it was a tower, and then it turned into a medic, and now it turns into a supply convoy. Uh, so we also have the muskman. He can be upgraded. Infantry. And we are broke. So I won't be able to do any other <laughs> units, which I think the only thing that's left to do at this point is the, uh, uh, the turn the ironclads into destroyers. Uh, I'm surprised we were able to upgrade all those for less than 700 gold. Well, that's the, a steal. Yeah, we have that, uh... That policy that reduces the cost by fifty percent. Oh, so I, see. I, I always keep that for this the entire game cool. if I can. Mary Shelley created her other work, by the way. I always try and keep that as long as I possibly can, just because it saves you a ton of money in the long run. I feel like it's one of the best policies as far as uh, saving money because the upgrades are uh, just extremely expensive. Oh, you know what we should have did? We started should have started moving troops over here to Urfa uh, oh. in preparation to send them off to one of these islands. Uh, so which one do you think we should go after first? Oh, we got a blizzard jinx. Oh, and I figured hit the fucking <laughs> settler. That poor little settler, man. At least they're in an RV and not just walking around with a little knapsack. I guess he just missed it, maybe. Chemistry but still, the dirty part of physics. I feel bad for him. Because we have had, yeah, first he got snatched. Snatched by the barbarians, <laughs> then we rescued his ass, and then he's already got to travel across shitty terrain and settle in city, shitty terrain. But on top of that, he got hit right in this blizzard. Never had a blizzard down here. Gather it just happens. To... Grandchildren, I shall tell you a tale. Uh, barbarians have appro approached Istanbul. Seems like they do have a privateer here. We got a submarine. Let's shoot some torpedoes at him. Didn't even need the second torpedo. We've got a wooden ship. Wooden ships don't stand up to the torpedoes too well. Wonder why. All right, so we wanted to get the aluminum with our builder here. Let's go ahead and do that. I think we have to destroy the farm first, don't we? Yeah, before we're gonna be able to get anything else. So do that. Uh, we got this apostle that I had gotten before we started. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and have him be able to spread the religion two more times. Let's see what else we got up here. Of course, we got the violent storm we already know about. Uh, we purchased the missionary, and our cities are bitching. <laughs> we need more stuff. What else is new? We got chemistry. Jinx is a big fan of chemistry. I like chemistry. Wasn't that like one of your favorite subjects, like, uh, in, subjects school? in school? I liked biology better. I was good at chemistry though. I was never really much of a science guy. I was really good at math, even though I didn't like it. Uh, but my thing was. You know, history and uh, there's social studies in the lower grades, polit and politics. Kind there's of stuff a lot of government. boring shit when it comes to chemistry and like I, having to you know take your notes mm -hmm. and all that. I find chemistry to be like the worst subject in science. Frankly, I find it ugh, just <laughs> really boring and and tough too. It's difficult. It is really difficult. Uh, we get drones. Uh, get another spy and a flood barrier. Uh, oh. So this is. Protects coastal lowland tiles in the city from flooding. Okay, uh, so none of these are... We have the boost for it, but really it's just not that that useful right now. So we're not going to get that. Uh, let's go for one of these other ones. So we go for advanced flight to get the better planes. Uh, we can go for rocketry. What Didn't we have like a plan 
I think we were getting chemistry for the rocketry, weren't we? Let's learn to fly before we shoot ourselves off into space. Well, if we want to go the science route, then getting the spaceport and, you know, the missile silo and all the, all the stuff for the, uh, uh, to be able to launch our rocket. I think it'd be good to get it as soon as possible. So we'll go ahead and get that first. Okay. And we can recruit a great engineer. Uh, he grants 400 in production towards a wonder construction. So, yeah, we'll take him. Are we for, building any wonders? Uh, yes, we actually are building a wonder here that we didn't know if we were going to get done in time. Oh. Uh, but it's only three turns left, so he wouldn't even get there in time. Watch he get snatched right out from under us. Mm-hmm. Uh, and so London has finished up their war department. Uh, so we can get the research labs, uh, which would be great. Or we go for broadcast center. Now, we are actually doing better in culture right now than we are in science, so we should probably go for... Uh, uh, the science one. I'd also go for the seaport. This would generate more gold and food and all kinds of good stuff. Yeah. I think we are going to go for that one, the seaport. London can grow a little bit quicker. Because, uh, yeah, you can see it's going to take 30 turns for them to grow right now. Let's go to the seaport. Uh, though, let me just double check and make sure there's no uh, units that we really need. Or wonders. No. I'm not seeing any units. Oh, aircraft blocks. carriers, man. Get some spec ops. We need air. The spec ops are just the recon unit. <laughs> they can pair drop though, so that's kind of cool. Do they have cool uniforms? Uh, you would assume they'd clothes. have to, right? They they better. Atomic air melee unit, naval unit that can transport air units. Yeah, we need to get ourselves aircraft carriers, man. Uh, so yeah, I'm not gonna get any of these right now. Let me just double check, check the uh, wonder situation. Taj Mahal's only seven turns. <laughs> <laughs> The problem now is though that the the, the, the capital is like yeah has such a small amount of tiles left to build on. It's all wonders. It's all wonders, yeah. <laughs> uh, so we can go ahead and do one more here and get another artwork. All right, awesome. And we now have a governor uh, upgrade, which I don't know what we're gonna get here. I think we're done with the educator. Uh, the financer. Well, there's some okay stuff there. Uh, the Cardinal, again, not really seeing much there uh, that we want to get right now. Could always get something for uh, Victor. And what do we have so far? Okay, so we only have the starting one here. Uh, city can now be put under siege. Accumulate strategic resources in the city, gain an additional one plus per turn. Units defending within the city's territory get plus five combat strength. Okay, uh, your city's within nine tiles, gain four plus loyalty per turn towards your civilization. I guess that might be useful. Uh, maybe we'll get that. Let me just see if there's anything else that we can get. Uh, like here. Uh, settlers train the city. Do not consume uh, population. Yeah, not really seeing anything here, guys. All right, so I guess what we're going to do is uh, go ahead and go after his upgrade. We'll get that one. Since that is on the front line, uh, that's in our city here, Kanye West. No, oh, is that where he's at? Yeah, yep. If, if any any city was going to get attacked, it would be that one. Good luck uh, with that, Victor. All right, so let's go Kinda ahead and control. continue our railroads. And we'll then move up here even quicker with the railroads going all the way up to Newdenham. I don't know if Newdenham has a railroad. Let's go and take a look real quick, see if we need to build one here. Uh, looks like nope. they do not have railroads, so we'll Just have to get them. Modern road. And then remember, we got our great admirals out as well, which is exciting. Uh, so, yeah, let's go ahead and get them moving. Move them out of here. I don't know where I'm going to move them just yet. We're also going to move our battleship, though. Where are you going? We got this big old battleship just sitting here. Oh, we haven't finished construction. Oh. We got one turn yet. I was left. like, why can't he go? Yeah, I was like, why can't he go out of there? Yeah, we still got one turn left, guys. We do need to get those crabs. Yep, we need to... After we finish upgrading everything, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get a builder purchased in Portsmouth so we can take advantage of all the stuff. Uh, there's the iron over there on the island that we could get as well. So yeah, we got a few things that we'll need to get with that builder. Uh, so we have this guy. Oh, okay, this is our great engineer. I'm trying to figure out who the hell he was. Uh, so we have two wonders building right now. One here, but it's going to be done in two turns. And one there. That'll be done in three turns. And it looks like that is all, folks. 
What is New Market working on? Is that like a government building? Mm, no, that's the airfield one oh, that improves it. Uh, it like gets experience for air units or something like that. And yeah, and I think you might be able to use more, have more air units there. So you know what, guys? We're just going to place them here. Let's leave them outside just so I don't forget about them. Let's put them here for right now. Although I think we just rotated these yeah. two. Yep. <laughs> oh, my bad. Not too many great people. Yeah, just kind of sitting around here. Actually, you know what? We actually have multiple. Who's this guy? Uh, oh, okay, so that's, all right, so that's another, another great engineer <laughs> that we have sitting around. Yeah, we just got great, got great people many. sitting around everywhere. Can we trade them? No. <laughs> we have uses for them. Uh, so we got the settler done. Uh, but we never did move the, uh, the army the over troops. here. So we're gonna need to do that. And we should probably escort them with the ship as well. I think that'd be smart. Uh, so let's go ahead and get some units moving over here. Let's see which ones we want to move first. I guess we could do a red coat. Uh, that might be smart. We got this red coat. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to take the great admiral, or excuse me, great general, unlink him, and have him move to this infantry unit. We'll link him. And then, because we're not going to move, I don't think we send a great general, you know, off to uh, colonize. So we'll bring a red coat unit, but that is not going to be enough guys we're gonna need something else maybe like a horse unit or something some type of well i guess we don't really have horse units anymore no huh? we don't i think there's that one horseman down south yeah down there we could always just buy something here at the capital there's also uh john the swede he could go uh is he send him to go colonize the, the barren north yeah who didn't want to just sit here not doing nothing he was Enjoying his retirement. <laughs> he's one of our highest. No, he's not our highest level guy. Never mind. Or Where is our have, highest level guy? He can also be hungry for adventure. He's right there. We're going to send him off. Yeah, I think he wants adventure. Seems like an adventurer to me. I'm tired of sitting around listening to my wife. Yep. <laughs> that what she does. Yeah. All right, so we're going to go ahead and just uh, have this thing skip till we get the units to... Uh, you know, escort it. Let's go and sleep. And, oh. We need to go ahead and have that guy set up to guard. And same with this guy. Uh, though I think we had him situated up here. So that's where we'll have him wait. Alright. And, oh yes. More railroad building, guys. Always with the railroad. Mm -hmm. All right, so we'll build a railroad there. You're welcome, Belenius. And then let's go and tell these guys to all go to sleep as well. We'll be able to bring in nudism quicker. So our apostle is here trying to convert Cardiff. It looks like we are almost there, but yeah, not quite. I don't think we're going to get it done, guys. They're just going to keep sending people over Well, that's there. why we're going to leave somebody over here to kill every Protestant that comes here. As soon as he gets here. And, you know, I know that that's our friend and all, but... Is what it is, guys. He needs to stop. He needs to stop it. His behavior is unacceptable. Mm hmm It's not appropriate. All right, so let's go ahead and try and convert them. It's not going to be an easy one. And this guy is stuck in a jungle. Tabaki. He is so outdated. I think he's like, I know he's at least one behind, but I think he might be two behind. The skirmisher? Yeah, yeah because I he's been... I think he is two behind. Yeah, so long since he's been, uh, been back home. There's Jinx's chocolate. Chocolate. And if we weren't coming for the chocolate, we could come for the oil. Yeah, only chocolate. Mm-hmm. There's multiple reasons to set up something there. Does anyone else in the world have chocolate? I don't know. Uh, we could always contact That's somebody and see. the only candy bar on the entire planet. I don't think so. I would assume there's probably some chocolate, maybe just on the other continent. Oh, These fuck motherfuckers, off, man. Uh, just making guy. all these demands of us. <laughs> And they can't even back him up. I'm still not convinced he's not a douche. <laughs> like, he's changed his ways. I don't see it. I'm looking to see if they... He's got salt. Just looking for chocolate sources, he guys. He's a salty fucking dude. I was thinking India would have chocolate. But apparently not. Yeah, I'm not seeing any chocolate. That might be the only source of chocolate in the whole world. You know everyone's gonna bug us for it. Mm-hmm, as soon as we get it. Give me your chocolate. Uh, so here we can create another great work. I'm just glad chewing gum isn't a tile. 
and Storm Rage is on, and Unit Veil promotion or Apostle here has got another promotion. Okay, further spread his triple strength in cities of other civilization. We should clearly do that one, and then we have to remember that and make sure we use him against Mongolia and not against uh, a city state. Uh, so we completed the hangar here. Uh, so let's see what we want to get next. Seeing if there's anything military wonder wise, and there's not. Uh, so let me just see here. All right, yeah, we're not really a whole a lot of options here. Why can't we get the dam? There's no suitable location. So they won't be able to get power unless they get oil or coal power. Mm-hmm. Okay, it's good to know, we I guess. We gotta get that messy energy. Mm-hmm. Let's go in and build some units, guys. Uh, so let's see what we want to get here. We did need builders. We did, um, but I kind of feel like we need more tanks. Tanks. We got, like, no tanks. Do we got one we? tank. Yes, of course no we do. No one else has any tanks. And, and I wanted to show you guys something. So you may notice that this is a little bit different, the building screen. You notice there's that square there, Jinx? Yeah. You know what that does? It builds. Builds what? The tank. No, pressing X builds the tanks. So what do you I think? I don't so? know what square does. So you hit square, and this is how you build the core and, and army oh. units. So these are more powerful than a regular unit. Uh, you can also combine like two units into, into a core, and then three units into an army. Uh, so you can see that you're actually saving production with this. As far as like their combat abilities though, it's not it's not double, guys. Look at the melee strength of the tank, it's 80. Melee strength of the tank core is only 90 and 97 for the for the army one. Oh. And so you're not really you know, it's still almost double the production, or not quite. Uh, but definitely double the resources. Uh, it's you know, two oil here for the core. It's one unit? It's just one unit. Oh. Uh, but it's more powerful. So we're going to go ahead and try and get the more powerful units. Uh, in fact, we're going to get the army one. I know it's 20 turns, guys, but he's going to be badass. So he's we're going to get that. three stars. Mm -hmm. Yep. Upon Lars. <laughs> so Istanbul got itself the canal finally, so we can now bring all those ships out. About time, man. <laughs> Took them long enough. Good God. Uh, so don't they need shit? Doesn't like Istanbul like need a bunch of things? They need... Grand. I guess they're not. I guess they're alright on housing now. I thought they were short on housing. Does canals provide housing? Maybe it did. Maybe that's why they're not short on it yeah, anymore. It looks like there's tiny houses. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, get something else. And get them the zoo. Tiny houses. Market, so they can start earning us a bit of money here. Or sewer. Let's do the market. Just because we can get it in five turns. And... And money. Mm -hmm. Money. I like a money. I want some money. Me too, man. Watch out for it, the uranium. <laughs> <laughs> this was a rough month, guys. I did our finances for the past month for December, and good God, it was a bad, bad month for us, guys. Uh, we spent so much money. Uh, between, like, the... We already talked about the plumbing issues that we had. Oh, my God. Yeah, and that was pricey, guys. Very expensive. Plumbers are always stupidly expensive. So yeah, between Thank the God for him, though. Oh yeah, yep. Yeah, between the plumbing issues, and then we had our daughter's birthday in December. So, you know, we gotta get birthday presents, all that kind of stuff. And then our rabbit had his procedure. Poor guy. Poor guy had his balls chopped off. <laughs> the pet rabbit. And so yeah, it was just a rough month, guys, uh, financially. And so now we're just waiting for that tax time, man. <laughs> just trying to make it to tax time uh, until we get the. Uh, the tax return and you know it's gonna be weird the first day the first year where we don't look for the tax returns when we actually are gonna owe money mm -hmm. I know it's in the future like eventually we're gonna be making enough money might be years from now <laughs> where we actually are gonna have Someday to pay day we're gonna pay taxes and I'm not sure if I'll be happy or not about it and you may be questioning like why the fuck would you be happy about paying taxes because you got to a point where you're making so much, you're not so poor that the government's like, eh. Yeah. You can keep your money. It. You can keep your money, man. Pennies. <laughs> we don't need it. It's like when your little kid offers to help pay the bills. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's all right. And yeah, they give you the dollar or whatever. Yeah. Like, I'll give you my dollar. Yeah, that's a very sweet sentiment, but that dollar is not going to do anything. <laughs> it's unnecessary, kid. I'm just looking to see if there's anybody to fight. Ooh, there's one right there. I think we should have two sitting over there, then, Kung guys. Fu 
So we're going to go ahead and move, have this one go ahead and start moving over there uh, so that we have two sitting at Cardiff. And then uh, let's go ahead and have this guy do his attack. Uh, he's not going to spread it. Instead, he's going to attack their unit and uh, see what he can do. Remember, we get the 10 plus from being the world religion. And our religious order just gives us plus five combat strength as well. For the world religion? Well, the one that was voted in. Oh, I see. Yeah, the one that's voted in with the World Congress. Gotcha. That's called the world religion or whatever, I guess. Everybody wants a bit mm -hmm. of naked time. It should be the religion everybody adapts, honestly. Uh, let's get cows. Ooh. And then we'll also go ahead and continue our railroad building. And mm, oh yes, John the Swede. Let's go and get him moving up. I wish we had railroads going up to Urfa. We don't even have yeah. fucking roads going up there. We should probably get another military engineer with their monies. Alright, so he can't go any further. The jungle is stopping him. And yes, aluminum. Alright, so we finally have a source of aluminum that has also boosted nanotechnology. And this guy's gonna have to chill. Until we get escorts. I don't like nanotechnology. You don't trust it's it? It's creepy. It's one more thing Jinx doesn't trust. I don't trust anything. Mm -mm. I don't trust our dishwasher. <laughs> you don't trust the dishwasher? <laughs> well, I don't trust it to clean the dishes. <laughs> it doesn't do a good job. It does, yeah, it doesn't, it does an okay job. Uh, I mean, if you, I mean, it does its job if you make sure you scrub it, all the shit off it, which then of course, you're like, what was even the point as well of using the, the fucking dish. dishwasher? Yeah. Uh, so... I just don't like, like, why does your fridge have to be smart? You can look in your fridge from your phone. Uh -huh. <laughs> I don't want hackers looking in my fridge. Because <laughs> that's what hackers yeah, are worried about doing, Jinx. Looking in your fridge. Hackers like, well, I could go to the store, but my neighbor's got some pudding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to steal your pudding, Jinx. Yeah. Uh, we're about to get a. Uh, uh, a wonder done, so we're gonna have to shut up here in a second, so just prep yourself for that. Because oh, that no. wonder is just about I don't think I done. Can. Can't shut up. Talking about snakes. I forgot that I think we were waiting to spend our faith until after we got the wonder, because I think that wonder makes them better. And we also have entered the modern era, which is actually the reason why we didn't skip ahead. It is a beautiful and important monument and an international intercultural treasure. Unless and until it can be shared by both religions in harmony, which would be a grand idea, it should remain a secular building, honoring both religions who have made it beautiful. All right. So remember, this does make missionaries and apostles get one extra spread. Pretty useful, guys. Uh, so this is where we're going to want to build all of our guys from here on out. Uh, and I think we want to renew this. Success. Uh, but yeah, that's the reason why we didn't skip ahead, though, is because uh, I knew we were entering into the, the modern area here in a couple turns, which means that we're going to get to pick, like, a new uh, a new thing. Yeah, well, we sure entered into it with a fucking fizzle. Because I mean, modern. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, we are no longer the Cesarean of Geneva. Ugh, who got it? I don't know, we'll have to look at that, because we do have envoys to spend. Uh, and we got all new city-state quests now, too, from every city-state. Now that we're in a new era. Good grief. Uh, we can get a apostle. And I wonder if the error score applied this this turn, you know, for the next, uh, the next uh, you know, error. I think so. You'd hope so. Uh, now let's go get an apostle now while I'm thinking about it, guys. Uh, or else I will forget. Yeah, because there's a lot going on. Mm-hmm. All right, so let's go ahead and get the apostle. You can also get the naturalist, late game civilian who can create a single national park to attract tourists. Might be something we want to get a little bit later when we're not so deep in the religious wars. Uh, and let's go ahead and uh, pick our bonus for the age. Uh, so it looks like we have some of the similar options that we had before. The same one. So this one, I think there's a new one. I two, see no new Isn't ones. two arms a new one? Unlock a special CB, which generates 75% less grievances in the former war. And can be used immediately after denouncing the target. And you get a plus 15% production towards military units. 10% production towards industrial era and light wonders. Campus districts provide the bonus. Uh, production bonus as well as science. Is that what we had last time? We might I go think for so. That. I think we're going to go for that again. Yeah. A lot of the same options, guys. Because we wanted that science. 
Mm -hmm. I mean, this would be useful though. The three, the plus three starting populations for city settled on a different continent, since we are setting settlers out. Uh, you know what? I got an idea, guys. Uh, but let's go ahead and do this first. Let's get the heartbeat of steam. I think that's the best option for us, because it does let us build the wonders quicker. And uh, more production is nice as well. And steampunk is cool. Mm-hmm. True. 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 Uh, so let's go ahead and get this guy moving to the front. Look at how far he can move, Jinx. Mm-hmm. Mm, that is fantastic. Magic of choo-choos. Mm-hmm. The magic of choo-choo trains, guys. Why do we not have like passenger trains anymore? When you do my real life? Yeah. Well, we do. It's just, uh, you don't ride them. <laughs> we do have them, though. Where? Well, Not I mean... in America. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yes, Jinx. Well, we need one between the Springs and Denver. I'm all for that. Yeah, that would actually be nice. Get um, people so off the damn road. We can get the Golden Gate Bridge here <laughs> to connect this little spot. Uh, man. I think that would be fantastic. <laughs> I don't think so. I, I, there's got to be a better place to use that. I know somebody else is going to get it before us because I'm I'm taking my time getting it, guys. But No one else knows what wonders are. Apparently not. Uh, and the canal doesn't provide housing. We were wondering if it did. It doesn't. All right, well, I guess it's time to probably get another district, unless we want to get another naval unit. I'd like another naval unit, like another battleship. Battleship. Or the aircraft carriers, because eventually we're going to want to get some planes. Uh, so, you know, yeah, we're going to get the aircraft carrier. Uh, and then, of course, we can build the uh, Armada to make the art aircraft carrier even better. Why not? Let's build a super aircraft carrier. Super carrier. That's what we'll call them, too. Oh, we got to upgrade our destroyers, Jinx. We're just going to float around in the ocean, bullying people. Mm-hmm. Like, look at my big ship. So these are the, des yours. the, the destroyers, guys. How come the, uh, the Great Admirals haven't updated themselves? <laughs> They're still in wooden ships. So yeah, this is the destroyer, guys. If you're curious what it looks like. Because they've never actually been on the open sea. Nope. Uh, so what else? I know that we have another ironclad How somewhere. How can you be a great admiral if you've lived your whole life in a lake? Are you talking about these ones? Yeah. The ones that are leaving? That's not the same great, great admiral, though. He's been in a battle once. Oh. Remember he fought those pirates? That one time? That one time? Mm-hmm. He tells all his, all his friends about it. It's a story that he tells everybody. <laughs> All right, so what we want to do is we want to go ahead and get the uh, the three things we're going to get with this builder is the crabs here, although we need two sources of crab, uh, the iron and the stone. Frankly, there's a lot of stuff we need to get, really. Uh, so we'll go ahead and start with the iron. Because uh, I, eh, you know what? Actually, let's start with the, the crabbies. Crab legs. Crabs. Mm. Mm -hmm. I like imitation crab. <laughs> Jinx does. She's not lying, guys. Uh, so it looks like I missed a spot with the railroad. Oh, okay, because it didn't connect right. Yeah, I got. That looks I told you funky I got as hell. Weird. I didn't know what was going on with that. Yeah, that's pretty funky. All right, well, I don't think there's any way to fix that. I think it's because of all the ro these roads here mm -hmm. and stuff that are kind of odd. All right, well. So, like, the tiles are railroaded. They're just not actually connected. Yeah, I don't think it'll affect anything, so we'll just leave it as is, I suppose. Uh, let's go and get the railroads going across here, though. All the way up to Urfa now. I know railroad building is stupidly entertaining, so. It is. You guys enjoy it I a lot. I wish we could do more of it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so fun. Uh, so, Horatio Nelson, we're going to have him go all the way over to here. Join that battleship. We gotta have him leading the capital ship. Uh, and nope, I don't want to remove him from the game. <laughs> I don't know how that fucking happened, guys. Are you sure you want to murder that guy? <laughs> and then we're gonna move this guy. Um, I guess he could just sit with the submarine, I suppose. Chain them together and go sheep. The submarine fishing for crabs. Hmm. Submarine yes. fishing for crabs. Yep. Mm hmm. The crab fishermen by trade when they're not submarining. Um, hmm. What's going on here? Why can't he move further? I don't know what was going on there. We'll have to take a look, guys. Uh, but now we finished the wonder here. We'll go ahead and take a look, see if there's any other wonders we would like to get. 
Uh, could always get that one. It's 26 turns though. I'm sure there's other stuff they need. Oh yeah, it looks like they need some housing. So let's get them some sewers. <laughs> I thought you were going to say tiny houses. <laughs> no, we'll get them sewers, Jinx. Uh, it's quicker. Uh, and it doesn't need a spot. Uh, so Nobody wants to live in the goddamn sewers. Apparently people do, man. We've got so much housing being provided by sewers. Maybe it's nice inside there, Jinx. You don't know. I guess bums do like sewers. Bums like sewers? Mm-hmm. I'm sure they wouldn't pick a sewer, though, over uh, somewhere else. Well, bridges are their personal preference. Hmm. What the hell's going on here? I'm a little bit confused. Oh, okay, I see. We moved him over here, and he's still got movement points. Got it. All right, that makes sense. I ain't done yet. All right, so let's go ahead and get this guy going over to the coast so that he can hop on a boat. And once we get all the units here, guys, and I think we're going to purchase another settler, guys, uh, here so that we can send two settlers at the same time. Ooh. Mm-hmm. It's a big bon voyage. That's just one thing we could do, I guess. We don't have to do it that way. Uh, well, where is this builder going to go? What do we need? What do we need? Oh, there's a source of stone down here. Not being uh, used. Oh, there's also some horses. A bunch of shit we haven't we taken advantage of there. We are ponies. Mm-hmm. All right, so let's go ahead and build the railroads. Swimming and everything, really. Oh, where'd that guy run to? Except for oil. Well, you hurt his feelings. <sighs> where'd he that? made fun of his wee-wee. Damn it. Where did he go, guys? <laughs> <laughs> he ghosted. Or he used all of his, his spreads. Maybe, but he had just arrived. He hopped off the boat and started singing. All right, well, I'm not seeing them. Oh, you see that they're getting the, the special units too, Jinx. Mm -hmm. See, that's why we got to get them or we're going to get... Yeah, look at all these units are oh, special. Wow, okay. See what I'm talking about? So if we didn't do that, if we don't build them like that, then we're going to get uh, we're gonna get beaten. Because he's combining his units to do it. Oh. That's how he's getting it. You can, like, smush them together. Mm-hmm. Cardas is finally new to Jinx. We did it. We finally did it. Uh, and then I think we're going to get some rice. Friggin' Christians keep washing up on shore. <laughs> <laughs> Shipwrecking and shit. They're coming by whale belly. <laughs> yeah, but he's turned, like, everybody Protestant, man. Well, I mean, they do have snacks. Mm-hmm. And nobody yeah, wants snack from our people. No. They pull them out of their robes, they and then you see their, and then you see they're naked, and <laughs> oh, nobody wants their no. food. <laughs> God, we got so many people that need to move, man. Uh, so let's go ahead and get this guy going. To I don't know if we've gone to their capital yet. I thought you were gonna say you had a stash of candy somewhere. I got really happy. Uh, nope, no candy now anywhere. I'm really Jinx. sad. I want some milk. <laughs> no candy. I don't Jinx. care if you're naked. <laughs> um, so Geneva got seized by Genghis ah, Khan, damn. and he put a lot. He put all his points into getting mm -hmm. Geneva. So that's a problem, guys. All right. Well, he didn't have any friends. So what we want to do is we want to make sure that all the territories around us are ours. So Cardiff. Villainous, Geneva are the two key ones that we need to get. Three. Or three key ones. What did I say? <laughs> two? I can't count, yo. Numbers are hard, man. They're hard, man. Is it this one? Yeah. Uh, so let's see if we can't get them. So uh, Villainous is already ours. Uh, how about Cardiff? It is ours as well. But let's just put it into Geneva because uh, getting uh, the nine would be enough. So put it into that one. And let's see if we can find another beneficial place to to send some. I guess we can send them to Cardiff. Yeah, I think that's where we're sending it, guys. Just looking for one that might give us a bonus, but they're all sitting at four right now. All right, so yeah, I'll put them in a car Cardiff here. I don't want to have to fight those Geneva soldiers mm -hmm. if we can avoid it. I mean, no, no, Genghis. You can't have any friends. No friends for you, man. All right, so let's go ahead and turn. And, uh... I think it's like three turns before we get our troops out into the sea and our settler has arrived so we can go ahead and establish a new city. Exciting guys. A true Pax Britannica. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Sean Bean, man. Why do they make you listen to that every, every time single we... time, right? Yeah. yeah. We need to, uh, oh, we got a builder there. Uh, we need to come up with a name 
for that place. It's it's cold and icy. It needs to be fitting. Uh, and we got this apostle here as well. All right, we can go ahead and try and uh, flip Cardiff again since we just flipped it. So that's what we'll do. I'm gonna spread it one more time, make sure that they don't uh, convert on us anytime soon. And uh, I guess we'll get the fox. The fox camp. We can name it BFA. Your people celebrate historic motives, uh, moment. This is our first snow city. It's the first city in a snow place. This is like a terrible place for a city, guys. It's, it's gonna be so difficult for them to grow. Uh, but they'll be all right. They're only here for the poison. Yeah, we're only here for the oil and the uranium. And because there's a it's volcano be a nearby. It's going to be a shitty existence, and they're all going to die anyway. I feel like it should be called, like, Iceland or something, since it's got a volcano, and it's, you know, icy, you know? I know Iceland's pretty green in some parts of it. It's a very beautiful I want place. to go. It's also freezing nobody fucking else cold in the, in the winter. Nobody else family wants to go it's to Iceland. It's not that nobody wants to go to Iceland. It's that nobody wants to go to Iceland before we go to other places. And we all want to go to either <laughs> Europe or Japan for our first international trip, which... Is never gonna happen, by the way, guys. So, never. No. You know, one way we could we could get these guys uh, grown quicker is just purchasing these cheap buildings. I think that's the best best way to do this. I uh, like the granary and the, the monument. Yeah, I think that's the best way to do it. Of course, then they don't have anything to build. That's quick. True. After it's that. Take years. Yeah, it's gonna take years. Uh, but of course, they'll they'll get more people here. Give them a water park. <laughs> that's what we should start with a water park, Jinx. I kind of feel like if we start with anything, it should be the industrial zone. I think in, in uh, production is going to be a problem here. Yeah. Yeah, we'll go with the industrial zone, guys. It's going to take 197 turns. We need to enslave those foxes. Put them to work. We could build it here. This looks like a great spot for an industrial zone. However, we might be able to get like a dam here and then you'd get that bonus. Hmm. Interesting. I guess we'll put it there because it is three plus. That's pretty damn good, guys. Can't afford it. Uh, we don't have 190 gold. Hmm. Okay. What the fuck are we gonna build here temporarily? I don't even know, guys. Let's take a look. See if I can find something for them to quickly build. Uh, not a wonder, obviously. A unit, maybe. A uh, builder would be 85 turns. I, I for I miss the the ability. Maybe it's in projects. Um. And maybe you get it later in projects. You remember how you could use, like, your production to get money or something like that? You just put your yeah. production into money in mm -hmm. previous sieves? I missed that. And maybe it's still in this. Uh, I kind of recall it might be in it. Uh, maybe it's a project or you unlock it with a tech or something. Because, uh, yeah, there's, like, nothing for us to get now. Uh, nothing for us to work on. So we'll just waste production until I get the money next turn, guys. It doesn't matter. We'll just turn off the... We don't need it. Because I'm not going to wait that long for another builder. All right, so it's in our turn. Now that we got the uh, the new city here, and refuse the deal, and uh, we probably won't be able to play this turn, guys. No, I'm not giving. It. As soon as I get she wants new all stuff, your yeah. As soon as I get it, they ask for it. Uh, but yeah, we're uh, not gonna be able to play the next turn, guys, because it is the end of the episode. But man, we did not make it very much this time, guys. We did like three fucking turns. There's just, so much to do. Yeah. Like, this is crazy how long it's taken. I know we're talkative. Um, we're spending, you know, time talking. Um, and we'd probably get, like, maybe one or two turns more if we didn't talk so much. But if we didn't talk so much, then it wouldn't be us either, though. That's kind of what we do, man. So, yeah. Uh, let me just see. Yeah, we're going to get that one there. So, yeah. Uh, we're just making extremely slow progress, guys. It's just uh, ridiculous how slow things are going. Uh, there's just so much to do and so many units to move all that good stuff when your empire gets this big it's just uh extremely time consuming and yeah we really need to get this settled soon guys because as you can see uh, mongolia has cover has the entire coast covered and they're gonna start blocking He's it off reaching. soon yeah if we don't want to have our access cut off this route we have to actually settle it down here or yeah. just or we can settle it further and then buy the tiles so that's kind of a problem um, but yeah, we have to, we're gonna, that does mean that we have to settle this one first, guys. There was the question on which one to settle first. If we don't want to have to go around this way, which is kind of the long way, comparatively, yeah, then we gotta make sure we settle here first. Uh, so we'll do that in the uh, next episode. Hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure you leave a like on the video, subscribe to our channel, hit that notification bell, and leave a comment. Hope to see you on the next episode, and thanks for watching, guys.